Hi, I'm Dr. Nishant Yagnik. I'm head of neuro in Fortis Hospital in Manasar. And uh, today I want to tell you about multiple sclerosis. So multiple sclerosis is a disease that is difficult to understand. And that's why the diagnosis is often delayed. And because it is delayed, patients often uh, find treatment late and that can lead to disastrous consequences because timely treatment in multiple sclerosis can make a huge difference for the rest of the patient's life. Now, multiple sclerosis happens because the immune system, our immunity, uh, finds that there are certain parts of our nerves that it mistakes for germs. It thinks that these parts are germs, so it makes antibodies and fighting chemicals against these, which can go to different parts of the nerves and affect them in various ways. Multiple sclerosis can happen in the brain, in the spine, in the eyes, and in many segments that have the specific target for the nerves. Now, when multiple sclerosis starts, when this starts, patients can have a different sort of course, and on the basis of this, different types of multiple sclerosis exist. For example, a patient can have an isolated multiple sclerosis incident, which means that they can create these antibodies once and uh, that will affect their system, but it will never happen again. Now, but the most common form of multiple sclerosis is called relapsing remitting multiple sclerosis. This is the majority of patients. This means that once the patient has a multiple sclerosis attack, um, the patient improves from that attack and after a few years can have a second attack, a third, a fourth lifelong. After every attack, there is a phase in which patients actually improve. They get better until the next attack and then they get worse again. They never get better to the exact stage they were before the attack. So the course is like if you have an attack, it goes down, you get better slowly, has an attack, goes down, has an attack, goes down. So there are other forms of multiple sclerosis, early onset multiple sclerosis, secondary progressive multiple sclerosis, primary progressive multiple sclerosis that are much worse where it doesn't wax and wane, it doesn't have an attack pattern, it just continues to progress which is very tough to treat but uh, fortunately these forms are much less common and much more rare.